Hey guys, okay, so we're on part two. Um, it's June 12th, 2023. Well, technically it's the 13th, but I, um, but I got this message on June 12th, 2023. Um, I claim that Jesus Christ is the son of God. He's also God. He came to earth in the flesh, bled on the cross, rose on the third day. He died for our sins and he was born of a virgin. Um, ignore the people on YouTube who are impersonating me. They use my picture. They're doing long paragraphs now. Sometimes they say, write me, but they're trying to get you to donate to an orphanage. I'll never ask you for money, so it's not me. And if you click on the picture, you'll see they have no subscribers. So just ignore them, block them, report them. Okay, it's just Satan's minions trying to scam you. All right, so here's the rest of the message. We're on part two. Um, my children with my spirit are humble and kind. They are loving they are embodied by my spirit and they are guided by the Holy Spirit. I love you, children. Please wake up, O oh sleeper. I am the good shepherd. I am your teacher. I'm trying to show you. I made a new covenant under me. I'm trying to show you how you live righteously through me by believing with your heart, I am Lord. But you are stubborn and set in your own ways. You rely on the teachings of man instead of learning my word derived by the Holy Spirit. I do all of this because I love you. So please wake up. The groom shouted out. The groom shouted out, I am coming. But the people slept. You are my chosen. You are my prize. And I am your Lord God and I have spoken. Leviticus 1.14, and if the burnt sacrifice of his offering of the Lord is of birds, then he shall bring his offering of turtle doves or young pigeons. 1 Corinthians 2.11, for what man knows the things of a man except the spirit of the man which is in him, even so no one knows the things of God except the spirit of God. Now some of these scriptures will probably go with part one, obviously, because that was only a part of the message. 1 Thessalonians 2.8, so affectionately longing for you, we were well pleased to impart to you not only the gospel of God, but also our own lives because you had become dear to us. Matthew 15.9-10, and in vain they worship me, teaching as doctrines the commandments of men. When he had called the multitude to himself, he said to them, hear and understand. Jeremiah 1.11, moreover, the word of the Lord came to me saying, Jeremiah, what do you see? And I said, I see a branch of an almond tree. Jude 1, 2, mercy, peace, and love be multiplied to you. Habakkuk 2, 3, for the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it will speak and it will not lie. Though it tarries, wait for it because it will surely come. It will not tarry. Okay, guys, that was the message. Um, like I said, I was, I'm visiting my mom, but I was at, um, the restaurant yesterday and the Lord came over me so I started writing a little bit on my phone why he was um, giving me the message and then when I got home I wait on the Lord you know so he he likes to give me pieces sometimes so last night he gave me a little bit more but I was just it was like one o'clock in the morning and I was just toast I was like Jesus I can't I can't right now I just can't so um, I went to bed, but I woke up at like four or something just so I could, you know, make the Lord happy. Um, guys, I'm seriously doing this for Jesus um, and to wake up his children. There's no other motives. I mean, what person gets up at four or something in the morning just to do a message? I believe it in my heart, guys. I'm convicted by the Holy Spirit. I've been saved for 12 years. Um, and the Lord just started pouring his spirit out on me December 30th. Um, when I tested this message, he gave me Jeremiah 1, 5, and it says something, I earned, I, I made you a prophet known to all nations from the very beginning. Um, so I test the spirits, you know, after I get a message, but the Lord has revealed it to me that he has sealed me. And, and the girls um, from the devil getting in. So I know everything that I'm getting is from Jesus. Um, 
and but I'm still gonna always test it because I'm paranoid but I don't worry about that anymore and I wanted to tell you yesterday that revelation we had was amazing about the one minute and I don't so basically what we got was we got the time if you look at 1153 you know after he said look at all the coordinates in Israel on the map and then divide it by the time zones of 23 not 24 because you don't count um, Israel but when we were doing that and we were looking at other clues about how long it took the fish to swim to get to the net and then um, he if you look at the signs in the heavens there is a net part of the I think it's called the AU or something I don't have the Maseroth calendar I just go by what Jess and Jesus Saves says um, from Jesus Saves and so she explains the signs in the heavens um, so I just speak the words that Jesus gives me and then she you know has revelations on that the Holy Spirit gives her that but it has something about the net in the heavens but he had given me this message and she found the Holy Spirit led her to find the net in the water in the heavens. Well, the other day when the Lord spoke, when he was giving us clues about stuff, um, he had said, it's after the net. Um, and so I was like, okay. And then that ended up being like, um, it had 53 in it. So he spoke to me and said, 53 where is that in my verse what what are they um what did he say he said look at 53 in the bible so then i went to my bible app and i just put in 53 and i was reading all the verses and do that i um i recommend you do that because it's really interesting some of those verses they were like literally talking about exactly what we're talking about <laughs> it's pretty amazing and so we started doing that but anyway we ended up getting the time and I remember the Lord gave us 1853, you know, when we were doing the whole May 22nd, which started the ninth hour. Um, but that's seven minutes, and I got a revelation that seven minutes is completion. But when we were doing the time, we ended up getting um, one, one minute, like we ended up getting number six, or like, um, six until the completion so you can do it two ways it's like a spiritual thing it's either six minutes that you have to watch everything and see god's glory and then he gives you that time to repent before the rapture or as the rapture is happening he hasn't revealed that part yet so i'm not sure if it's like when the rapture is happening or if it's like right before but he did say you know the light show and all that stuff we're gonna see his glory because his whole point is he's giving you time to believe in him, to confess he is Lord and believe in his glory. And that was just such a beautiful, loving revelation from an amazing God that he would just, wow, give us that chance and give our family and friends a chance. So you can look at it two ways. You got one minute to repent because seven is completion or that six minutes. I think McKenna explained it from um, Holistic McMama on TikTok and McKenna McKee, McGee from YouTube explained it, you know, that, that, that there's that six minutes. So either way, I think it's just symbolism of how our loving God is going to give us time to, uh, our family's time to repent and believe in him. Okay. You guys have a blessed day. Um, I love you so much and I appreciate it. Like I said, ignore all those scammers on YouTube and Okay.